everyone. Welcome to my Dollar Tree empties. And I'm going to start with this Miss Freshly's Delicious Deals Glazed Honey Buns. You get six of them and they are delicious. So definitely would repurchase those again. I have a lot. I don't know where to, get, when to, where to start. I think I got this from Dollar Tree. They do, this is Olay. It is Moisture Outlast Ultra Moisture with Shea Butter. You get one bar, of course. Um, it is supposed to be 10 times more moisturizers versus a regular soap for smoother skin. And I do enjoy this. I think it lathers good. It has an okay scent. I finished this. It smells really good. It's the Glade Limited Edition Spray in Berry Pop. It smells really good. I picked up I didn't pick up. I finished the Bolero Papaya and Coconut Cream Softening Hair Mask. And I did enjoy this. I like their hair mask. This is the um, Cleansing Jelly Facial Balm. And it is made with ginseng, vitamin A, and aloe. Vitamin A and aloe. It is Awaken Skin and Cleanse Away the Blah. blah Revitalize, revealing healthy, soft skin. And I did not enjoy the scent. I didn't enjoy the Jelly Facial Balm, but I didn't enjoy the scent. So I went and repurchased that scent. I don't like ginseng scents. So I did pick up a coconut one. I haven't tried it yet. Um, so... Hopefully, I like that scent better than the ginseng one. But I have heard people say that they didn't like this, the coconut scent, that it doesn't smell like coconut. So, that's something to keep in mind. But I've already purchased it before I heard, like, their reveal. This is the Feminine, the Feminine Foaming Wash in Creamy Coconut. This is supposed to be compared to Summer's Eve Foaming Wash. It is fresh and gentle and no harsh chemicals, and I did enjoy it. You can get, they have an orange scented one too. I finished an Ajax with the bleach, stronger than dirt. <laughs> um, I think you get 33% more, and they have Ajax and Comet at Dollar Tree, and I like to clean my kitchen sink with that. So I have repurchased it. I love this hair dye. This is the permanent cream hair color in medium brown, and I love it. You get gloves. The okay, you get the color cream, the developer, and the plastic gloves, and the instruction instruction pamphlet. I dye my hair maybe once a month, and I do like that it is a cream hair color. So I really enjoy it. Maybe I'll do some kind of like snacks. So I got the Brock's Auto Mix Mellow Cream. So it's got these, the candy corn, the pumpkins, and then that other, um, what is that called? It looks like candy corn, but it's kind of like a chocolate flavor. And I do... Um, maybe like one bag of this I can do like every, I do like a bag of this every fall. Um, I like the pumpkins are my favorite and the candy corn is my second favorite and the chocolate one is my least favorite. Then these are the Spicy Cheddar Toast Chi by Lance. They are, um, sandwich crackers, spicy cheese sandwich crackers. And these are pretty good. I like them. And my husband likes them too. And then these are good too. These are the Charms Blow Pops, the lemonade stand. So you get lemonade, raspberry lemonade, and strawberry lemonade. And they were good. I like them. 
I'll do some lashes next. And I think my friend Rosa sent me these in her Valentine's Day giveaway. And I do like them. And um, these are the set, these are the Color Mates lashes, but they're in different packaging during like maybe this was during Valentine's Day. So bold and diva. Two of my favorites. And I heard bad reviews about these tweezers. These are mini tweezers by Sassy and Chic. You get a pointed tip for ingrown hairs. You get a slanted tip for brow hairs. And you get a flat edge for thick hairs. So it's three pieces. And I think they're great tweezers. I heard um, like a couple bad reviews, I think. But these are really good. So... I wanted to try them and see if I like them because there's something that I, I got one of those wall stickers on my front door and it is, I'm having a hard time getting it off like on the walls in my home. They're easy to peel off, but with the weather and the sun and heat and all that, it is a headache to get off of my front door. It was like a welcome wall decal from Dollar Tree for fall <laughs> and... I think I got it last fall or the fall before and it started like bubbling up so I wanted to remove it and it is challenging to remove like it's got a lot of sticky residue and everything so I was going to use those tweezers for that but they work great and I'm not going to waste them on ruining them by, by doing that. I'm just going to get some something else to take that off. And then I have these... Um, Charcoal toothbrushes and the activated charcoal um, fluoride free whitening toothpaste. It fights plaque, whitens teeth, freshens the breath, um, free from sulfates and artificial dyes. So it is extreme by natural white and it is in the fresh mint. And these are the toothbrushes. So my son likes these toothbrushes, the bamboo handle toothbrushes. I didn't like those. I like this one to use with the charcoal toothpaste together. So, I did like those. Um, I don't know if I would repurchase them. Like the charcoal toothpaste. I really, I like another toothpaste at Dollar, from Dollar Tree called the Ultra Bright. I don't know if I've seen any more of the charcoal toothpaste. But, I enjoy the Ultra Bright one. And, but I will buy those for my son because he likes the bamboo handled um, toothbrush. And so this is what I'm talking about. I could take or leave the charcoal toothbrushes, toothpaste, and the floss picks. These are by Dental Guru. I do like them. I don't really love the peppermint flavor. But these are the charcoal infused floss picks. And they are peppermint, natural, and sustainable oral care you get 50 picks and it does have kind of a thick string and I the reason why I have two is because I empty them into my container that I have on my bathroom counter that I use that I put um, my floss picks and like I have one beside of it that I put q-tips in let's do a couple hand soaps so this is the soft soap Soothing, clean, aloe vera fresh scent. Um, I think my son really liked that scent. This is the Spa Soap Milk and Honey um, Cream Soap Refill. And I don't like this scent. But this is the Clorox Fragancia Lavender with Eucalyptus Hand Soap Refill. I don't think my son like. My son doesn't like it either. My husband really didn't say much about it. <laughs> I have a couple face masks. And I did enjoy both of these. And they left my skin very hydrated. So this is this Bolero Sunflower Facial Mask with a rose hip oil. It's damage control. It protects and restores skin with an infusion of vitamins and nutrients that revitalize, rebuild, leaving your skin soft and refreshed. And this one you are supposed to leave on for three to five minutes and rinse off any residue 
And then this is the Freeman Beauty Infusion Cleansing Sheet Mask. The Charcoal Plus Probiotics Instantly Boosts Purity Clears Pores. It is a bamboo sheet mask, 100% bamboo sheet mask. It's serum a serum infused sheet mask. It's dermatologist tested. And this one I left on for 20 minutes and you just let the, you can take your J roller and just, um, you know, pat it into your, roll it into your skin. <laughs> You don't have to rinse that one. And then this is the Coconut Cream and Vanilla Bath Bombs. You get three, and this is relax in a warm bath and let the stress melt away. So I enjoy the Valeri Bath Bombs, and I really like that scent, the Coconut Cream and Vanilla. And I have a couple of the Valero Facial Wipes. So this one is the Micellar Water 3-in-1 Rose Plus Coconut Cleanse Hydrate Repair. And it's for all skin types, so I enjoy this one. I really like that scent, the rose and coconut. And then I like this one also. The pink cactus water is soothing facial wipes. It helps hydrate and protect for clear, beautiful skin. You get 32. So I enjoy both of those. These are antibacterial moist wipes, so it kills your germs. Moisturizing formula for scent, convenient and portable. It's for your hands and face, and it is 20 pre-moistened wipes. And I actually use this to clean my car. I leave the, left these in my car to clean my door handles, my steering wheel, my key, my gear shift, and my hands. And I also use hand sanitizer. And I think I use these too. Or maybe I use these on my counters. These are the Clorox Centiva. Centiva disinfecting wipes and this is the Pacific Breeze and Coconut. Okay, I use these on my kitchen and my kitchen counters. And this is a um, little pack of a pocket size tissue. Cute little spring pattern with the spring and summer pattern with the butterflies. And I put those little pocket tissues in my purse, in my car, in my backpack. I had a few, another facial wipe that was in the bottom of the bag, and this is the um, watermelon and aloe facial wipes. They're hydrating and cleansing. You get 30 of them, so I enjoy those. And this is another of the paper sheet mask by Bolero. It's the pineapple juice extract clarifying paper sheet mask, and this one you leave on for five minutes, and then you rinse your face off or wipe off any residue with a damp cloth and then I really like this facial toner as well by Bolero is the soothing facial toner in cucumber and aloe and it's paraben free color free I do like this I finished this Bolero pineapple plus coconut Pineapple plus coconut plus lime shampoo. It is nourishing and paraben free. And I did enjoy this shampoo and I used it with along with that um, hair mask that I showed you, the smoothing hair mask. And then I finished this shave gel. It's personal care shave gel, moisturizing with vitamin E and aloe vera. It's in Berry Burst, and I didn't enjoy this, but I think I prefer the foaming um, shave cream. And then this is the silicone facial mask applicator by Sassy and Chic, and I do enjoy these um, mask applicators. This is a um, sugar soap works. It is oatmeal and coconut soap. And it is a bar soap, and it looks like this. And it's very lightly scented, but I did enjoy it. It does have a good lather, and it does have bits of oatmeal. This is um, not animal tested. It's cruelty free, and this also has a 24 month shelf life after you open it and start using it, which they don't last me long at all. Maybe they'll last me a month, but definitely not 24 months. And I'm just getting rid of this. I'm going to stick, there's a black one that I get from the Dollar Tree, 
that I enjoy better for this one it was not as bad as another one that I tried but again I'm not really a fan of um, this one either I really like the black one and it's just clutter in my shower so that's why I'm getting rid of it I have a couple kind of like food items I guess with the um, Complete Seasoning by Badia. It's gluten free and I love this season. It is delicious on shrimp and chicken. I put it on like the little Cornish hens. It's really delicious on that and I put it on my shrimp. And let's see. It is good for with meats, poultry, fish, soups, salads, sauces, vegetables. And it looks like there's onion, garlic, um, basil, and probably parsley. And I tried, we tried these, my family did. They're the Sunny D Orange Strawberry. It's 80% vitamin C per bottle. And we like these. And I have some more drink mixes. So I really enjoy this Canadian Dry Cranberry Ginger Ale. These are the sugar-free six drink mix packets on the go. You just put them in your water. So that one was really good. The Cherry 7-Up was really good. It doesn't really taste like Cherry 7-Up. It kind of tastes like a Cherry Limeade. And it is um, sugar-free also. Very good. And then this is the Starburst all pink strawberry drink mix. It does taste like a Starburst and it is zero sugar. And my family did not like these. Me or my son did not like these. So I would not purchase those again because it isn't Starburst sounds good to put it like for a drink, but it really I don't I don't think it tastes good as a in a as a drink. And I want to, I think I want to try the blue one. Like, is it blueberry? Maybe I want to, I think I want to still try that one, maybe. I don't know if I've ever tried a blueberry Starburst before, like the candy. So I might like that one more because I keep associating this. It had like a strawberry milk flavor kind of to me. I don't know. It was weird. Then I, I finished this. This is the um, Loretta seasoned coating mix for chicken. It is crispy oven style and I did use it on chicken and I did like a parmesan chicken and I also used the other packet because you get two I believe. Yeah, you, it contains two bags for shaking. Complete mix just add water. Just add water. I don't think I added water. Okay. It says moisten chicken or pork with water. And I wash my chicken before I cook. So, <laughs> mine is, so I, now I get it, I guess. Um, I did the other one with meatloaf. Because I think you get two packets in here. Cause I did one with chick, one ch with chicken and one with meatloaf, and it was okay. I have some pins, and I love these pins from Dollar Tree. They come in like packs of um, three during like Mother's Day, I think. So I really love them. Beautiful patterns, and the pins write great. And I do like this four-in-one stylus pen. It's a pen stylus microfiber cleaning tip and a phone holder. I like the pen. I like the stylus. It does have the microfiber cleaning tip, but my phone, the phone holder, it doesn't, if you need something to hold your phone, I wouldn't even get this one because it doesn't really hold my phone. But I have a iPhone XR, so maybe that's why it's a bigger phone. But it is 
were great. And it is by E-Circuit. And I really like that brand that they sell at Dollar Tree. I have two of my lash glues. They're by LA Colors that I finished. And they just get um, kind of like thick and you can't really use them anymore. I do like the applicator and this is why I like this is my favorite um, lash glue. I love this applicator. To apply my lashes. I don't like the ones where you just like um, they just come in like a tube. I prefer that type of lash applicator. This was one of my dryer balls that I got from Dollar Tree and it broke in half but I have had these for a while. I have a couple hand sanitizers. So this one is the Purell Advanced Hand Sanitizer kills the most germs and this is cool cool melon this and this is cool melon lime and then this one is a dollar tree hand sanitizer is pineapple scented it is an act it's actually an antibacterial hand gel then i finished one of these i've been painting a lot of white so I finished the Crafter Square Acrylic Paint, three fluid ounces, the in white. I bought another one of those. I have the Glade um, Solid Air Freshener in Lemon Fresh, and I didn't get any scent through off this at all. And I have two candles, and I. If you watch my Dollar Tree hauls, I think you kind of know how I feel about the Dollar Tree candles now. I'm not purchasing them anymore. I'm going to try my hardest not to purchase any more of them because they just don't have a scent throw. And even when I burn two of them together, they don't. I don't get any kind of scent throw. If it is, it's just a light scent. And this one is um, cocoa, coconut and mango. Had an okay scent since I did finish, did did burn them all the way. Cold on cold throw, they're pretty good, but the remaining ones that I have, I'm gonna burn them either like in my filming room or my bedroom or something like that. I'm not gonna put them in like the like I have my living room, dining room, and kitchen are very open. So I don't think I'm going to burn them in there anymore. And even like a lot of people will say when you have a bigger room you can burn two. But these were burning close to me. Like they were burning on the coffee table. And I was sitting on the couch and I really, the scent is like really light or no scent at all. So. And even when I burn them like in my bedroom or a small room, I don't get any throw really. So that is my Dollar Tree MDs. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.